Welcome in the open house of the Department of Earth Sciences at the University of New Brunswick. Earth Sciences concerns the Earth systems, their present behavior and features, and evolution since the formation of the planet. It is one of the most interdisciplinary domains of sciences that uses concepts from all major scientific branches. Earth Sciences deals with the Earth's landforms, the water at its surface, in the ground, in the oceans, and the water trapped in the glaciers. Earth system evolution, including the evolution of life forms, the climate, and the environment. The earth materials, so the minerals, rocks, sediments, and their chemistry. The earth physics, for example, the movement of the tectonic plates and the origin of earthquakes. Resources, including energetic resources. And very importantly, Earth Sciences also concerns the environment protection and remediation and mitigation and understanding of Earth hazards and the other planets. There are many people you can talk to about Earth Sciences and do not hesitate to reach out to any of us if you have any questions. Your first year instructors, Drs. Timmermans, Shaw, Bruster, and Keeley. The chair of the Department of Earth Sciences, Dr. Carl Butler, and Audrey Limoges, director of undergraduate studies. And of course, Luke Langille and Braden Harker, who are your peer assisted learning mentors. Our department is relatively small, which makes for a very personalized learning experience. And our team covers a great diversity of geosciences, from glacial geology to geophysics, environmental hydrogeochemistry, sedimentary geology, economic geology, paleo-oceanography and paleoecology, metamorphic petrology, igneous and experimental geology, structural geology, and we also have the Quarter Main Earth Science Center. This mosaic of photos represents a sample of the research activities and type of work that we are conducting. A very large part of our research activities start in the field, where we observe, measure, and sample different components of the Earth system. And then we come back to the laboratories where analyses are done using a suite of instruments and techniques. Our department is strongly involved in research activities, but also in outreach activities. You probably did not have the chance to come this year yet, but the department has a small museum that exhibits a beautiful collection of minerals, reconstructed ecosystems, and has interactive activities. And Dr. Timmermans organizes activities with schools. You may wonder what the career opportunities are for someone who graduates from Earth Sciences. These are very diverse, and there are career avenues in governmental institutions, in academia, if you like research, or within the industry and non-profit organization if you prefer more applied work. And on this slide, you see a list of examples of career work titles that can give you an idea of the diversity of work that can open up to you when you graduate from Earth Sciences. And here they are listed in four main categories with examples as environmental geoscientist, geological engineer, geoscientist, and other avenues that you may not think about at first, but which are also very interesting. The Department of Earth Sciences offers options in general earth sciences and environmental geosciences where you can choose courses from two main streams. The first is the hydrogeochemistry stream, which is related to water, and earth system stream, 
which is more focused on climate and environmental changes. And we also offer joint programs with civil engineering and physics. Geological engineering is offered jointly with civil engineering. And all these programs can be done with co-op work terms. And it is important to mention that geoscience has professional associations, meaning that you can only apply for your accreditation and practice in certain sectors if you have all the educational requirements. And our program is specifically designed to ensure that you can apply to these professional associations at the end of the study if you wish to. But there is no obligation and we also offer more flexible degree programs for students interested in studying earth sciences but not necessarily practicing applied geoscience as a career. We have the geological studies option in the Department of Earth Sciences. We also have interdepartmental program options with two specializations in the program of environmental sciences with responsible resource recovery and water earth interactions. Of course, you can also go with a bachelor in general science, bachelor of arts and science and bachelor of arts in earth sciences. And finally, there is also the option of doing a minor in earth sciences, which requires a minimum of 24 earth science credits. Highlighted in yellow on this slide are the first year requirements for these different options. And additional biology courses are required for the environmental geoscience and environment science options. If you are interested to see our complete list of courses and details about our undergraduate programs, you can consult our website and we also have program handouts available. Please contact us using the email address shown here if you would like to request one copy. Our programs are focused on practical experience. As part of your curriculum, you will gain strong experience in the field. Four field schools are offered, typically after the winter term exams or just before the start of the fall term. During these field schools, students are trained on how to think at large regional scales, how to observe, interpret, and how to approach complicated problems, and these are the foundations to mapping and stratigraphy. During the geo-environmental field school, geological, geochemical, geophysical, and hydrological methods are applied to an environmental site investigation. This field school includes one week of field work, followed by one week for the analysis of data and preparation for a comprehensive written report, summarizing the field investigation, summarizing the results, drawing conclusions, and making recommendations at the end. Field trips are also organized, and most of our courses have a practical component which allows to directly apply the theoretical material seen in class and learn how to use different analytical tools while consolidating your learning. In your fourth year, you may also have the opportunity to participate in the HAIL trip or McAllister Silver Standard trip and these international field trips are organized by students, for students, with a strong financial, logistical and scientific support from the department. But our department is also strong with social, learning and professional growth activities, we have the Bailey Geological Society and there is also the Geological Engineering Society. We participate in the Peer Assisted Learning Program and we try to offer as much opportunities as possible for students to participate in conferences.
Financial support is very important and our department offers more than 30 scholarships with grants ranging from $500 to $7,000. And here is a simple list of different scholarships and one simple application makes you eligible for all of them. There are also opportunities to find good summer jobs and we will try to connect you to potential employers as much as possible. Examples of summer jobs include work with the provincial and federal geological surveys, research at UNB, environmental and engineering consulting firms, government regulatory and transportation agency, resource companies, and geotourism. What to do next? We encourage you to consider the different programs and options that match your interests. It is always a good idea to discuss interests and objectives with departmental advisors to have a look at the courses that are offered and select those that interest you and choose your major. And verify your course selection with your advisor to ensure that if you wish, you complete all the requirements for professional registration. And I am the advisor for the Department of Earth Sciences, so do not hesitate to contact me if you have any questions. If you want to find more information about our department and stay connected with us, please consult our website and we also are present on social media so you can connect with us on Instagram and Facebook.